Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome to Alex Lawn Adventures YouTube channel. On this channel, we're going to be doing everything outdoors, and most stuff outdoors, lawn related. We'll do some, some spraying, some fertilizing, everything. Right now, we're in southern Iowa, and our lawns are dormant. We are in the winter months. Today, we're actually getting lucky. It's 70 degrees. Uh, we're going to have some severe storms coming tonight, though, so hopefully everybody stays safe. But we just washed up the snow water. We're going to do some winter maintenance on this. But first, we just use this hose right here. And so we're going to winterize this hose. So we're going to use an air compressor and a nozzle like this. And we're going to run all the water out so that way when this is outside this winter, it don't freeze. You can also do this with a leaf blower if you have one. Works just the same. But we're going to blow this out first, and then I'm going to just show you one of my maintenance things that I do to my winter equipment. So we're just going to stick this in here. We're going to shoot some air in it. So we're going to try to prevent some rusting over the years and this is also going to make the snow not stick to it as bad. It may, when it's wet snow, it may stick a little bit, but that way the water beads off. So we just have some regular wax that we got at the hardware store in town. Just wax this in front of the shovel real quick here. Now there's many things that you can use to do this. There's people online that say you can use Pam cooking spray, whatever you want to use, you can use. And you don't have to do this either. This is just what I do. This sit for just a bit before we wipe it off or buff it off. The snow blower is freshly washed, so we are going to wait until it's completely dried off before we wax it. I will eventually do both the front and back side. I will also do that. Another good thing to do is check your tire pressure in your snow blowers before the first snow of the year. Change your oil, make sure you have fresh gas in it, make sure it runs good, inspect everything, make sure everything turns. I like to wax the inside of the spout so that way the snow will shoot out of there better. Just keeps everything running well. We're just going to wipe this wax off now. Kind of buff it off. Now this shovel is brand new this year. Because last year I had a plastic shovel. And it did not do so well. The first snow, the metal guard, the two rivets on the metal guard, popped off 
and then this was bent into a U. This is my snow shovel from about four years now, and it has seen better days. Plastic on the back's wearing down, metal is falling apart. If you guys have any recommendations for good snow shovels, comment below. Let me know. We also have a just a cheap plastic shovel that we got last year. This one is actually held up decently. It's it's got some use to it, but it, it's not broken or anything yet. But hopefully this metal one, we're gonna try a metal one this year. I've seen they have poly ones, but they are pretty expensive. I didn't want to spend that much not knowing much about them. But if you guys have good experience with them, let me know. But we're just gonna buff this one more time, make sure we got it nice and clean. the back side the shovel will be ready to go we'll do the snow blower and it'll be ready to go for the winter thank you guys for watching this channel if you want to see anything uh, comment below let me know what you want to see we're going to be doing some soil testing this spring we're going to be doing some spraying some fertilizing um, I got some comparisons of lawn equipment that we're going to do uh, some battery operated equipment some gas powered equipment so we got a few things in the future planned, but if you like this video, please give a thumbs up and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. Also guys, forgot to mention that my girlfriend Allison has started her own YouTube channel also. It's called Allison's Creation and Designs. She has cricketing projects that she does. She has a business through that, a Facebook page. Um, I'll link that in the description below if I can figure out how to do that. <laughs> New here, so we'll see if we can do that. But in this contest, whoever can get to 1,000 subscribers first, their, one of their subscribers will get some merchandise from us, a free giveaway. So go ahead, like our videos, subscribe. Thank you guys for watching.